So in the last video, we looked at how we can run our API request and test from the command line using the new man tool. But one thing uh, which must have striked you is the reporting is not that great in Newman, right? So it's a tabular report which is displayed with not much details or it's not kind of presentable if you are going to use this as a report for your stakeholders or your for your teams, right? So generally when you are working with any automation, be it UI automation, desktop automation or API automation, you require good reporting, right? Now that has been solved by someone who has developed this Newman reporter HTML extra, right? So it has got a very good reporting structure, um, which re uh, generates reports in the HTML format, right? It shows you all your features, what has passed, what has failed, and lots of other features which are available which, with this extension, which has been developed, right? Now, as you can see, it has got uh, lots of different CLI options, right? So you can use the same CLI to run this um, HTML extra and it will generate a particular HTML report for your collection, right? So how you can, let's see how you can do this, right? So on the command line. Um, so first you need to actually set up this particular um, HTML extra package. Now it's the same way we installed Newman. You can go ahead and install reporter HTML extra, right? So you can type this command HTML, sorry, npm install g and then Newman HTML extra, right? So so once you have Node.js, um, then it becomes pretty simple. So you just need to use the NPM packager to install your new men with this HTML extension. Okay, so this one. Okay, so um, I have already installed it, but still um, to show you, uh, I'm just doing it again. Hopefully it will, won't be too long, but still I'll pause this video for a few seconds and then we'll continue once it is completed. Okay, so now it is completed setting it up, um, downloading and installing it. So this is the version 1.17.4. It updated uh, some of the packages. So once it is um, set up, right? How you can use that? You can use the same new man run command with your collection. This time only additional will be a tag called R, right? For reporters option. And there will be passing HTML extra, right? So we can use the same command which we are using earlier. And here instead of and we will be using the R tag with HTML extra, right? So this is the command through which we can generate our HTML report. So it will be generated in the folder, uh, in your current, current folder, right? Where it is running this collection from. Now, if you want to change it, you can do that also, right? So it is uh, finished actually generating the report. So let's go back there, go back to C drive and GitHub. Here you will see another folder with the name Newman, right? And inside this, you will see a HTML document which has been created for you. Now just double click it as any HTML file and it will open it on a browser and you can then, you can then view your report your detailed report, summary report for your collection run, right? So you can see this is our uh, new man run dashboard. Now there is the summary. You can also change the theme here, um, total requests. It will show you what were the requests which should be ran for the collection um, failed test. What was the failed test, right? What was the assertion? So expected 2054 to be below 1000. 
skip test so there were no skip test so it, it gives you a pretty pretty good uh, dashboard right which you can use it for your reporting it tells you all the details in a structured format with good reporting style right so the file information timing and data summary of your all your requests so a very good report for your api testing which you can use or for your api automation whenever you are running any tests or any request you can use this as your html report instead of using the default report right so this is this was all about the html extra uh, reporting option which we have obviously you can uh, go through the cli options which are available right so some of them are like you can change the destination of your uh, reports so if you want to generate a report in a certain folder you can do that you can specify a path and then um, you can change the title you can um, show extra logs for your report you can skip environment variables environment data or global variables skip headers uh, you can uh, give it a spe specific time zone which you want to uh, display so there are lots and lots of cli options which you can use um, while you are generating this report right so go through this page and uh, it's pretty useful to use this report right which has been developed um, by martin and different contributors so great work done by martin on this one so this is the html extra report which is available for new men and which can be used for your postman api testing right